Thank you, Mr. Vice President. The Advocates for Human Rights and its U.S. partner, the Sana Foundation, which uses its Haitian initiative to combat poverty, commend the government of Haiti for its support of recommendations that address women's human rights, such as reforms to promote gender equality and combat stereotypes, assistance for domestic violence victims, and increasing women's access to decision-making positions. We commend the government for accepting recommendations on children's rights, particularly to expedite adoption of the Child Protection Code. However, we remain concerned over the government's noting of the recommendations to eliminate violence against women. According to human rights reports, there is no specific legislation on domestic violence, sexual harassment, or spousal rape in Haiti. Violence against women and girls increased significantly after the 2010 earthquake and, an ineffective and, a, and it's compounded by an ineffective judiciary with economic barriers as well as a low uh, law enforcement response. Moreover, nearly 300 children are estimated to be working as indentured servants. Haiti must continue to, one, address violence against women and girls, two, commit to promoting gender equality, and in three, increase access to high quality education opportunities for women and girls. We call on the government of Haiti to implement these recommendations as swiftly as possible, identify the specific actions it will take, its timeline, and funds that will commit to implement the supported recommendations. We further call on members of the Human Rights Council and all member states to urge the government of Haiti to work with civil society like the Sana Foundation. Thank you.